and the word of the day is boo, a term of endearment used by lovers. Hello, nice bird, boo. Uh, uh, uh. In my opinion, the worst thing a boyfriend can do is piss his girlfriend off. And I know the guys are probably thinking, man, Sergio, she's mad. Let her be mad. I ain't about to go and kiss her ass. I used to think that way too until I started dating the girls that could hold grudges forever until I apologized to them. And Friday is going to be here soon. And if she's still mad at me and I haven't kissed her ass so she can be unmad at me, I'm not going to get the booty and I need action on my weekends. How about I let these guys know about a bunch of things that will piss their girlfriends off so they can prevent from doing them. Forgetting special dates. Hey baby, um, <laughs> do you know what day it is today? Yeah, of course girl, I know what day it is today. What day is it today? Uh, hold on, hold on, I know. It's your, oh, it's your birthday. See, I knew that. I, it's your birthday, right? Oh, hell no. Nah. It's her anniversary, you dumbass. My birthday was a month ago. Why the fuck you think I kept asking you for stuff? Not only do you not know when your anniversary is, but now she knows that you don't even know when her birthday is. Lying to her that you didn't do the things she doesn't approve of. Babe, have you been talking to that girl that I told you not to talk to because, you know, she's a little skank and she gets around? What? Nah, babe, nah. You know, all you need to do is tell me once and I won't do it. Mm. Then why in the hell is there a text in your phone from her telling you, Good morning, babe. Huh? Oh, no, nah, come on. Nah, babe. That was a long time ago, before I was even with you. Your dumbass must not know that when you get a text message, it says the time and the date, you got it, and it says yesterday. One, you lied about not talking to her, and two, you lied about it being before you were with her when obviously she just found out it was yesterday. Not spending time with her because you're busy. Babe, are you going to be with me tomorrow? You know I really want to be with you, but tomorrow I got to go to my grandma's birthday. But instead, your ass goes to a party and she finds out the next day. Another thing that pisses girls off is when you ignore them. Whether it's you're with them and you're just completely ignoring them, not paying attention to them. Or they text you and you reply two hours late or maybe you just don't reply until she texts you the second time saying, Are you there? Or when she's calling you within the day and you never return her calls or pick them up. When you're too, too close to a girl best friend. Not all girls are crazy. They don't care if you have girl best friends. But they do care when they start noticing that you you talk more to your girl best friend than you talk to your actual girlfriend and you write statuses on Facebook like They're gonna be with my best friend Jessica this weekend, Woo! This motherfucker never writes statuses about me and I'm his girlfriend and why the hell does he spend more time with that bitch? When you talk to your girlfriend about your exes and the shit you've done with girls way in the past yeah, babe, you know, I was with this one girl a couple months ago that looked like Beyonce. Ooh, and she got down. Mm -mm -mm. She was so good. Uh, so why do I care? Are you trying to tell me that you want me to be like her? No, I'm not a stupid ass hoe like her. When your girlfriend is pouring her heart out to you and she at least expects you to be like, oh, babe, you're amazing, you know, thank you. But instead you say, man, babe, you say you feel all this about me, but yeah, you haven't gave me the booty yet. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. No, motherfucker, obviously you weren't kidding. Now she knows what you were thinking of the whole time she told you that shit. When you're out with your girlfriend and she catches you staring at other girls and then you say in front of her, damn, that bitch is hot. Or she finds out you're flirting with other girls. Bro, you're not with your boys. Wait until tomorrow that you hang out with your homie, Lil Crazy Killer Motherfucker, to compliment bitches about how they look. Don't do it in front of her. When the things you do all the time, she only does it one time and then you try and get all sensitive with her and get mad at her? For example, let's say you always reply to her text three hours later and the one time she replies to your text one hour later because she was helping her parents with something, you try to give her this attitude like this. Okay, so you want to reply to my text one hour later? What were you doing, huh? Were you with somebody else? Were you out fucking around with some other guy? When you start acting all hard and try beating one of her guy's friends up because she said a simple hi to him and gave him a little hug? When you're extremely insecure and you tell her all the time that she's gonna cheat on you and that you don't trust her. The worst thing a guy could do that will get his girlfriend extremely mad and most likely get his ass broken up with is cheating on her. 
Quit being a horny ass bastard and settle down to that one booty that you're always claiming that you love so much. And if you can't do that, just break up with her. Simple as that. No guy is perfect. They're gonna do these things. I myself have done these things. It's just up to us to make sure we learn from that and we don't do it ever again and we don't tell our girlfriends, babe, I promise I'm gonna change. I won't do this ever again. And then three weeks later, she finds out we do it again. Uh-uh-uh.